Hey guys. Um, sorry about the bad lighting. I'm outside and it's nighttime, so I'm just gonna have to. I don't know. Let's see. Here's some good lighting. There we go. Anyway, let me go over here. I'm sorry, guys. Um, I just wanted to fill you guys in. I got some candles lit right here, so that's a lot better. I just wanted to fill you guys in on why I haven't been making videos the past week or so. Um, I guess, you know, that old saying of life, when it rains, it pours. And that's definitely true because, you know, y'all know that I've been dealing with that stuff, with, about that stuff with my sister. You know, her being a total and complete bitch for no reason. And, um... Now I'm dealing with somebody else being a total incomplete asshole. And it's kind of, uh, it, you know, this, this particular relationship, it goes in a cycle, you know. Sometimes the person could be really nice to me and great. Other times, not so much. And it's usually when another person comes into the mix <clears throat> But yeah, I don't want to go into too much detail because, you know, it's, it's just life and sometimes, you know, people and situations don't pan out the way you hope, but, um, you know, I just have to stay strong and, you know, stick on, stay on the right path that I'm on, um, uh, and things will work out. I trust that things work out. They'll always work out for the better. Um, you know, as long as I am sticking to doing what I'm supposed to be doing and bettering myself, I don't, I really can't do much more to please people. Um, and I've kind of been staying offline because of, uh, mostly, you know, not watching videos because, um, there seems to be a lot of negativity on the internet, I mean, that's just, like, always thing, but, like, lately, the people that I watch personally, um, seem to be, uh, a lot of negativity going around in their lives, so, trying to find new people to watch. Actually, uh, I've just gotten, uh, recently into Korean pop music, which is weird, like, I didn't even know that was kind of, I mean, I, I kind of heard of K-pop here and there, but, like, I didn't think it was, like, something for me, because I'm not really a pop music type of person. But, damn, I started listening to this band called uh, Blackpink, and holy shit, it changed my whole life. These girls are, like, they make you feel powerful, you know, like, oh, they're so great. I love the band. If y'all haven't heard of Blackpink, I recommend you guys go listen to it. I mean, it's, it's more of like a fusion of like rap and pop and like tropical vibes. It's really good. Um, yeah. I wonder, um, two of y'all didn't, uh, answer me back, um, on the giveaway, um, by Angie. I sent your jewelry out, so you should be getting it any day now. Um, I sent it out, um, Tuesday. Uh, it's Thursday right now, so. <clears throat> you should be getting it. I had a delay there because, you know, shit happens in life. And I couldn't get to the post office. So, but I, I sent it out. So you should be getting it. And I really hope you enjoy it. I put something extra in there. Um, just for a personal touch. Just as a thank you. Because um, I really appreciate, uh, you know, any support that I get from you guys. Um, because really it's the only support I'm getting in my life right now, which is really sad, but whatever, you know, you have to cultivate your own support if you can't find it in your life. Um, and that's what I'm learning more and more is like, and I want to teach people these things that you have to, you have to really count on yourself. You only have yourself to count on. And that's not a bad thing. Like that, I think that's what we're in this life to learn is, um, you know, how to be alone and how to be okay with it. And 
not necessarily all the time, but like, you know, how to enjoy our own company because a lot of people don't know how to do that. Um, I certainly enjoy my own company. Of course, you know, I don't like it all, all the time, like I'm experiencing right now, but, um, you know, I'm having a friend right now who's doing some really deep introspective work and going within, uh, and she's 30 years old and she's just now doing these things. And, and I, I tell her all the time, uh, it's never too late to, um, restart your life. It's not, you, you can always do that. You can always reinvent yourself. You can always change the narrative inside your head from positive or from negative to positive. And it will change your outside world. It will change your perspective, which in turn changes everything. Because life is how you view it. It's not necessarily the reality. You know, like your reality isn't like my reality. And my reality isn't the next person's reality. We all have our own realities. And uh, it's all um, how we view things and how we cope with different situations and how we've learned to, um, and the coping mechanisms we've learned along the way. <clears throat> All those things factor into who we are and, um, you know, how we behave. But we can always change those things. Those things are not set in stone. Those are not written uh, and that's not like the end all be all just because you've been one way for so long does not mean you have to continue to be that way if you don't enjoy the person you are um, that's the beauty of life that's the beauty of uh, <clears throat> this world is you can always stop what you're doing if you're not enjoying your life and you can change it you can do something different uh, it does take courage to change um, sometimes you know you could get into a life where you're comfortable, um, but you're not happy. Um, and it's hard to push yourself out of that comfort. Um, it's, it could be tough, but, uh, to grow, you have to be uncomfortable. So, uh, this video probably didn't make a lot of sense. Um, it's just, you know, the, the conversations I'm having with people around me, my, my friend in particular, uh, it's just making me realize that, um, the things I'm thinking about and the things that go on in my head are bigger than me. Like, I don't know how to explain it. And it's really cool. <laughs> look, I look like a floating head. <laughs> no, I got this, uh, Alaska hoodie on. If I look like a, look, watch, I look like a floating head. <laughs> I'm fucking stupid. Um, but yeah, I'm out here at night. In the night, uh, I'll show you guys what I'm doing. I'm, I got me uh, a little candle set up with my cauldron, and I'm burning some uh, incense that I made. This is it right here. Ooh. Oh, oh sitting on the dang ground and it's hurting my legs but uh this is um it's got mugwort in it and it's mugwort is really good for like spiritual and and psychic awareness and stuff it's good to open up your third eye I, I, I really implore everyone to um I, even if you're not into like metaphysical stuff and uh, new age and all that kind of stuff, look into like just consciousness and um, quantum physics and things like that because it is such fascinating subjects. Uh, and it really tells you a lot about who we are and how this world is. Um, I've been doing a lot of research on dimensions and how um, they play a role in our reality. And it's all, it's really fascinating stuff. Like, I, I can't, like, summarize it and tell you guys what I've been researching because y'all know I'm not the great 
person to come to for summarizations or like, you know, shit like that. Describing stuff. I'm really bad at that actually, as you could tell. But yeah, I just wanted to make this video um, to get some things off my chest and let you guys know why I have not been making videos. Um, I'm going to really try to get my shit together this coming next couple days. Uh, work on a couple new videos and get those out for you guys. Um, so yeah, I love you guys and hope you guys are doing really good. Bye. Bye-bye.